Oh, what is good, YouTube? Krishan checking back in with another video. Now, I know I'm a little later than usual with this prejudging video, guys, but we're going to go ahead and get to it anyway. So, I did actually watch the prejudging for the Boston Pro Show. So, this was your first call out Justin Rodriguez, Steve Kuklo, William Bonek, and Samson Dowda. And I apologize for the couple of hiccups that you guys will see in the video. This is a pretty good live stream, but there were a couple moments where it skipped a little bit. So from this prejudging, William Bonek honestly looks a lot better to me than he did last week. Maybe a touch better than he did. He looks to be a little bit harder. Steve Kuklo is still just as hard as he was last week, man. He looks incredible. Justin Rodriguez, he looks like he looked when he came out at the Arnold Classic. Samson Dowda also looks to be a little better than last week as well. But Samson doesn't have any oil on, which is something a lot of people were saying, which makes him look pretty dry in this lineup, as you guys can see here. But from the back, of course, it's going to be between Justin and William Bonnet. But overall, throughout this prejudging, they switched Kuklo and Justin in and out of this second place position. From the commentary, a lot of people actually had Justin in second, Samson third, and Kuklo fourth. But honestly, from this prejudging, guys, I like Steve Kuklo in second. And Justin Rodriguez in third. Steve is just so conditioned, man, so hard. I'm not, he does look a little bit fuller than he was at the Arnold Classic, but I do believe Steve can still be a little fuller than this. And once Steve hits that perfect balance of fullness and conditioning, man, it's going to be insane because he's going to be huge and peeled and that's going to be very very hard to beat for these guys but i'm excited to see how simpson data brings it into the night show as you guys can see here he looks a bit dry doesn't have any oil on that's what some of these guys were saying but they were saying that was also a good sign of being in good condition actually phil heath and dexter jackson were commentating with bob chicarillo when they said that so this is when they moved justin rodriguez to the middle and honestly justin looks good guys it's just Kind of hard for me to put him in second, having those uh, midsection issues. But from the commentator, everyone's seeing Kuklo in fourth, which I don't know why. Kuklo may be the most conditioned up there, but it's hard to tell because Justin and William Bonek are definitely on. But from this prejudging, I will have William, Steve, Justin, and Samson. And hopefully that video quality footage wasn't too bad, guys. But next, we're actually going to take a look at the next call out, which was Islam Muhammad. Phil Klahar, Max Charles, and Regan Grimes. And once again, I apologize for the slight hiccups that you guys will see in this video, but Phil Klahar did not seem to be very excited with this call out. Uh, he actually seemed to be kind of irritated the whole time he was on stage once he realized he wasn't in the top four. And Phil actually looks great, man, but it's just his midsection. He's, I'm not sure if he's had a hernia surgery. I'm not sure if he just doesn't have the best abs. But his midsection is holding him back. And I really hate how uh, Phil Klahar is uh, showing it on stage. You know, he's upset. It appears that he isn't in the first call out. And he's obviously letting it be seen on stage. And this is no means meant to put Phil Klahar down. It was just uh, something that I noticed, guys. And as fans of the sport, I believe that these guys should try to stay professional while they're on stage. But Phil Klahar is looking incredible in his real last spread and also as Regan Grimes. So Regan looks like he actually has on a little bit too oil, which is probably making him look a little soft. Max Charles looks incredible in this lineup, guys. This guy is a lot harder than he was last week. But I believe that Max doesn't execute some of the poses to the best of his ability. But it looks like and looks like for this second call out, they have it between Max and Phil. I believe Regan is probably just a little bit too soft to give him the nod. And Aslam Muhammad is on the left. He's a taller guy. He actually looks pretty good, but he was having a little hard time controlling his midsection in between poses. So I actually like Regan Grimes. I mean, I probably wouldn't have him over Phil Klahar, but I may have him next to I may have Regan Grimes and Phil Klahar, or either Regan Grimes and Max Charles battling that in this call out, but let me know what you guys think about this prejudging, guys. Overall, show is going pretty good. William looks incredible, guys. Maybe even better than last week. A lot of people have Justin Rodriguez in their second spot, Samson Dowd in third, Steve in fourth, which I have no idea why. But after prejudging, I have it as William Bonex, Steve Kuklo, Samson Dowd, 
Justin Rodriguez, probably going to have Phil Clohar next, Max Charles, Regan Grimes, and Eslam Muhammad. Sorry this video is a little later than usual, guys. I will be back for the finals. I hope you did indeed enjoy this video, man. Like this video. Sub to the channel. It's free. I'm out.